chilly here in the Northeast. So today we're going to escape to sunny California. Author and entertaining expert Nathan Turner is here to show us how to make one of his beachside faves. Fish tacos straight out of the pages of his fabulous new book. Oh my gosh, I couldn't stop looking at this Called book. Called Good. I love, love California. California. Yeah. I do. I love it. What are we I'm making? I'm hopefully bringing a little sunshine here. Come on. Fish tacos and we have a little Mexican chocolate stop cake it. in the back. It's all about the spices with yep. this. So we just put all of our spices into a bowl. There. I have cayenne pepper, I have there onion are. powder, it's all right there. there. Okay. It's all on the website. And then I broil them. I stopped what grilling. What kind of did you choose? Here I have cod. cod. And you can use any like white cod. fish. Yeah. Um, what we can do is just put a little bit of olive oil on them. Mm -hmm. And tip, make sure you oil the tray. Because okay. you're gonna put this under the broiler. Uh, and it's quick and you don't want to, uh, you know. Okay, yeah, you don't want the sticking. spice on after. A oh, lot of spice, oh, oh. I'm super on generous. Both sides, on right? both sides, okay. and then you Pop it under the broiler five to six minutes. Really quick. But watch it. Don't you just, overcook yeah, it. It'll yeah. burn quickly. Yeah, okay. Okay, so my favorite part about this is the slaw. And it keeps it fresh and crunchy and yeah. delicious. And it's simple. It's cabbage uh -huh. shredded. Put a little pico de gallo. Pico de gallo. Pico de gallo. Some green onion and Mexican crema, which, which is, is kind of this, it, basically. Okay. If you can't find it, you can add a little bit of cream or milk to sour cream to give it that okay. consistency. Okay. Toss that. A, a little salt. Little salt. Oh, that, and you're ready. That's it? That's it. What are you talking about? I know, it's super easy. So let's make a couple. Okay. I love to serve them in these little paper boats. Yeah. Okay. You can put two in a boat mm -hmm. and. Uh, <laughs> here we go. Come on. Keep going. Oh. Put two in a boat. Oh, okay. And then you put a little bit of the slaw on it. Okay. okay. Don't 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 slaw it. you up. Here, slaw it up. Oh. There we go. Okay. And and then do you put a, li a lime squeeze on it? Yeah, lime squeeze, a little okay. cilantro, and, and then they, look how cute that is. What if we would like to have some guacamole, guacamole on, on it. it? Let's take our boats back here. Okay. <gasps> this is yeah. a buffet that I set up. I love to put everything out and let people help themselves because that's how people oh, really want to oh, eat. Oh, thank you, hoodie. Come, uh -huh. Right. I, I forgot the boat. That's okay. Here. Here. Just Here's just one. Swap it on. Lather it up with guac. Thank you. Mm. And a little salsa. Oh my God. Doesn't this that, is what, oh my. It doesn't matter. Yeah. <laughs> Try oh, that's this. so good. And then um, hot sauce. Try. Put everything out on the table. Oh because, my God. Oh. What do you guys think? Mm. So happy. Who doesn't so love a little guac happy. in the morning? And a little mm. California mm. avocado. I'm just so look, really I'm just congratulations really. on Wait, the What's the dessert beautiful. down there? Just tell us real quick. Mexican funny. chocolate cake. Okay. That's it's fine. a great classic chocolate cake with a little bit of spice. All right, get these recipes, go to today.com slash food. And for Nathan's book, head to today.com slash shop. You're going to love it.